Okay, we're out here in the shop, and I've been asked by a number of carvers um, how I use this, uh, my new um, Dale Green push blade, straight edge push blade. Um, it's about three quarters of an inch long or wide, and about uh, oh, an inch and a three quarters long. Um, but it's uh, made by Helvey Knives, and uh, and so I'm gonna I'm gonna demonstrate a little bit how I use those. Um, in conjunction with my um, other knives. I've got the carving knife, my detail knife, and then I have these two push blades. They're not an, an exact chisel. They have a slight um, curve to them, um, but I'm going to show you today um, how you go about using one of those. And I've been carving on this little baseball player, <clears throat> and in this part right here, you'll see right in here where the hair comes across. I can I can come in there with a knife and cut that, but I'm going to be cutting right into that arm if I do that. And it's also going to be really hard to get back up under here because I'm running against that grain. So it's going to be really difficult to do. What I do is I take my little push tool and I invert it so that I've got the, the bevel edges up and I come right along where I want that hair to go. And I'm just going to come in here and push that in push that in, push that in and make a, make a cut, a rounded cut. Then I'm going to turn that over, I'm going to bring that tool, I'm going to come right back up underneath those arms, and I'm going to take that out, I'm going to take that piece out, and you can see it leaves a nice clean cut edge in there. Turn it over, I want it to be a little deeper, so I'm going to come in here, I'm going to cut that again, push that in, Come in here, push that in, turn it over, come back, take that out, and you can see it leaves a nice, crisp, clean line in there where I've cut that. And you can see where the where the hair is and where the shirt's going to come down now. Okay, that's one application for this. <clears throat> Another real good application is getting in underneath those the brim of that baseball cap. Um, or carving underneath a, 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 a cowboy hat. Take that tool and you just come back in here and start to cut. And it leaves nice, clean cuts. Take the smaller one, the little half inch, come back in here. And you can see it makes nice, even, smooth cuts. And you don't wind up with those fuzzies back there in the back end. Okay. <clears throat> Another nice um, application for these is working on these arms. If I want to keep that arm nice and round, I can come around here as a rough out and I can take that and I can just roll it and just push it right back in there. Come back this way. Clean that out. And it leaves a nice clean cut and it keeps the roundness of the arm okay that's very very important <clears throat> now if I'm roughing in a piece like I've got this cowboy hat this cowboy head that I'm working on I've got part of his hat um, cut out you can see where I'm going to be bringing in his the side of his face here I can bring this this is a good application for this uh, wider um, three-quarter inch tool. I can come all the way across here and I'm not putting a lot of pressure on my wrist when I'm doing this. And this is a nice, the nice thing about this tool is that it comes across, it cuts nice and clean. You can take it back, roll that back out, and you get a nice clean edge in there. You don't get any of those dreaded fuzzies that we woodcarvers all hate. And you can come across and you start to peel that off. You can use your knife for this just as easily. Pick up your carving knife, come across there. And you can start to bring that side of the face down. Okay, up here on the hat, <clears throat> same thing. Come across there with a V tool and start to open this up. And this thing makes really short work out of getting her bandsaw cutouts um, into the round. So 
so they're really easy to start to carve. Just take that, take that piece, come across here, and just start to plow that wood out. Makes it very, very easy to uh, start to get that bandsaw cut out into something that's starting to resemble a little bit of a cowboy hat. But see how quickly that wood came off of there? 